Closing market comments for Monday, March the 8th. Markets opened higher last night with corn up three, beans up 12, and wheat up seven. But as the trading progressed, we made on to new highs. With May futures trading at 1460, the highest since June of 14. New crop beans a new high at 1265. And new crop corn made a new high at 485. As the trading session moved on out of the morning session, grains were under pressure. With corn closing up one on the day, beans up three to seven, and wheat down two to seven cents. WTI crude followed the rally early, up 60, at trading at 67.98, the highest level since 2018. Rumors this morning that the Houthi, uh, Yemen Houthi Raiders had attacked Saudi Arabia with some drones, but no damages were reported later, so the oil sold back off later on in the day. The dollar started out about unchanged, but rallied to close up 405. Dry weather continues in Argentina and southern Brazil, but there is some rain predicted in the 6-10 to 10 day forecast for both of those areas. China did announce three, two more cases of African swine fever in two separate provinces. That's three provinces in all that are have reported they're not close together. It makes you wonder that we don't have more cases over there. A private analyst has said that uh, China has called 8 to 9 million sows over the past three months because of African swine fever. Malaysian palm oil was at record highs, up 4%. This drove soybean oil up and did lend support to the beans early before trading off later on in the day. Soybean oil was up over a full cent at one time. Soybean meal was not able to rally, but I think that's probably the African swine fever concerns. Uh, in other news, uh, the uh, weekly exports were out. Uh, the corn exports were 60.8 million. That's down from 80.6 million last week, but above last year at 32.7 with 47 to 71 expected and 60.5 needed. So right in the range of what we need. Soybean shipments were 21.6 million, down from 36.9 last week and about the same as a year ago. The expected range of 15 to 29, and we need to average 12.7 per week. Wheat shipments were 17.7, that's up from 12.5 last week, and 16.9 last year. Continue to struggle on wheat, only we need to average 25.2, and we haven't been there in a long time. Just a reminder, the WASD report on the crop supply uh, and stocks will be out tomorrow at 9 at noon, and the planning intentions will be out March 31st along with the March 1st stocks. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a good evening.